Good morning. Welcome to TNN. I'm Tish. And I'm Fons. Today is October 18th, 2019. Thank you for joining us. The character trait for October is respect. Respect is being considerate and honoring the feelings, opinions, and property of others. Remember, those who are nominated for showing respect will be awarded a dress down day. Don't forget to show our Pentec core values as well. There are respect, responsibility, and service learning. Volunteers from Pentec showed service learning last week at the Cathedral Kitchen. They help by serving food and packing bag lunches for those in need. Students from HOSA volunteered at the Out of the Darkness walk on Sunday. They helped raise money for the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. Starting today on TNN, we will be discussing a current event. This week's story involves a driver who was caught on camera nearly hitting four innocent teen pedestrians. Luckily, nobody was hurt. Here are some safety tips that you can follow to avoid situations like these. Also, remember that distracted driving is dangerous, so put the phone down when behind the wheel. Are you interested in becoming a published writer? Submit your work to a literary magazine this month. Mrs. Ducalis is accepting where I am from poems. There will be a creative and performing arts meeting October 24th in room 408. Please make sure to see Ms. Garcia or Ms. Skates for an application. It's officially sweater weather. Pentec is now selling generic hoodies that come in two styles. The hoodies are $28 for small sizes through large and $33 for 2XL and 3XL. It's an extra $5 if you want your name on the sleeve. The first order will be placed on November 1st. See Mrs. Tukalis in room 205 if, for more information. Are you a senior or junior and interested in going to college? Pentec 21st Century is hosting a college fair on October 29th from 6.30 p.m. to 8 p.m in the cafeteria. There will be representatives from different colleges with information about their school and the application process. Come and check it out. Congratulations to the students who earned the Perfect Attendance Award for last school year. They were given awards on Friday at the pep rally and celebrated with a trip to Hibachi Grill and Cinemissons. Great job, everybody. Now let's go to Marvin for the weather. Thanks, Tish. Today will be 60 degrees with partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow we'll see some sun for the first time in a while with temperatures reaching 60 degrees. Sunday we'll get back to partly cloudy skies with temperatures reaching 67 degrees. Monday and Tuesday we'll unfortunately see some showers with temperatures reaching 70 degrees and 72 degrees. And finally on Wednesday we'll see some sun again with temperatures reaching 68 degrees. Ladies and gentlemen, fall is upon us. Stay bundled up and warm. That's all I have for you this week. I'm Marvin, bringing you this week's weather. Back to you, Tish. The fall pep rally was held outside last Friday to introduce fall sports athletes and recognize students who earned perfect attendance. The seniors beat the freshmen and juniors at tug of war. There was also a teachers versus students football toss. Volleyball team played Lone AP on Tuesday. JV played Master Charter on Wednesday. Yesterday the girls played Gloucester Catholic and today they play Kingsway. On Monday the girls will play their last game of the season at Camden Catholic. Our Lady Tornado soccer team played a hard game against Cape May Tech on Tuesday. Their next game is on Tuesday away at Willingboro. On Wednesday the seniors will be celebrating their senior night. Everyone will be wearing pink for breast cancer awareness. Come out and support our Lady Tornadoes. Today, our boys soccer team played Overbrook away on th at 345. On Monday, the seniors will be celebrating their senior night. Come out and support the boys for their last game of the season.
come out and support the Tornadoes cross country team as they go to the Camden County meet at Timber Creek. Our annual fall homecoming was held on Friday night. The students who attended had a blast. Congratulations to the members of the homecoming court. That's all we have for you this week. Thank you and have a good one.